We're back. Ooh, I don't see any champagne. I don't either. Where is everybody? Yeah. So what's New location going discovered. on? Well, this can't be right. Oh hey, like Avina. On standby. I miss Avina. Yeah. They're doing an awfully good job of it. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Hey, Cora. Okay. How's it going? Welcome to the Nexus Gateway to Andromeda. I'm Avina, a virtual intelligence designed to assist you with immigration. Okay. Yay. Can you tell us where the welcome party is hiding. I'm sorry. My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. Such as right now. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, the Nexus. What is the Nexus? The Nexus serves as the central hub for the Andromeda Initiative's colonization efforts. It is the first destination for all colonists upon their arrival in the new galaxy. Okay. Please enjoy the many venues the Nexus has to offer. Yeah, it looks like there's a lot of venues. This is my favorite Nexus on the Citadel. Yep. <laughs> Wait. Providing a safe, stable, and prosperous environment is our primary goal. Not from the looks of it. Okay. <laughs> uh, current year, I guess. What year is it? The current year is 2819. After spending over 600 years in stasis, it's normal to feel disoriented <laughs> or confused upon Good. arrival. <laughs> Our helpful medical staff can assist with any physical or psychological after effects you may be experiencing. Hooray! Yeah, well, it is weird to go 600 right? years in the Always. future. Yeah. So where is everyone? Uh, living arrangements? Where do colonists live? Once you've cleared immigration, our helpful staff will assist you in choosing the home world of your dreams. Will it be the tropical okay. paradise of Habitat 7? Yeah, we were just, uh, we were just there. Habitat 3. Or perhaps the mysterious twilight world of Habitat 5. Those names are very alluring. Perfect. Rest assured, our Pathfinders have carefully vetted all colony worlds to ensure your security. Uh, about that. Yeah, not quite. <laughs> yeah. Habitat 7. That's where we landed. She's way out of date. Okay, well, immigration. How does the immigration process work? We ask that you submit to a brief medical exam to ensure your health and well-being after making such a long journey. Once you've been cleared, our colonization experts will assist you in finding your new home. Please be mindful of the queue. Thousands of eager colonists like you are <laughs> um, in their new life. Where's the queue? Okay. Uh, where? The place is deserted. Andromeda Galaxy. What can you tell me about the Andromeda Galaxy? How is it here? Yeah. Pretty? Yeah. It's great. So yeah, I guess yeah. we wouldn't have been to be trapped at FTL to get here. Yeah. It took 600 years. is located in a region known as the Helios Cluster. Here, you and thousands of your fellow colonists will be settling a new home. Fortune awaits. Well, that's our goal of this game. Okay, so let's log off and All get right. started with that. It's been my pleasure. Please see one of our helpful immigration staff for further... I think your head has like a square in it. Like something's shining in from the, behind it. It's Look. the window, yeah. Yeah, it's like it's going through her head. Yeah. That was helpful. Okay. Good. Well, alrighty then. So. I have a little search icon blinking. Plants are still alive. Yeah. How would they be alive? Actually, that's kind of crazy to think about. Hey. Maybe he's got champagne. Oh, hey, guy. Hello. Guy! Guy? Hello? Hi there. Is it a keeper? Ah! We're from Ark Hyperion, and wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Did you say an Ark? Yes. Which, a... which one is yes? <laughs> um... I, I did. Yeah, we just got in. And for what it's worth, your VI over there could use an update. But we thought you were all dead. What? Who are you? Or captured, or lost in dark space, or... Okay. But Why? you're here. You have no idea how much this means. What? I don't believe it. Whoa. Oh, hey, Tyrion. Hi. Garrus! I'm Tyrion Kendrick. How's it going? I'm on the Nexus. I'm Ryder. 
This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc could arrive, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. Why is that? But aren't you expecting us? You're the first arc we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. Oh. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. Okay, that would be helpful, because what the hell's happening? Our plan has. Oh no. We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off the Yep. Course. Sounds You're familiar. familiar with it. <laughs> yeah. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. Hmm. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. Whoa, okay. okay. Cora <laughs> likes to moonwalk. <laughs> the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we call them. Oh, what? Are things back to normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. Um. No word from kay. the other pathfinders? No word from anyone, period. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're in no shape to deal with an attack. Okay. We had a first contact situation on Habitat 7. Whole thing went south. They tried to kill us. That wasn't first contact. We know about them. Those aliens oh. are... were here. Oh. Okay. He was going to say they're going to be a real problem. He was. You should know our what? command structure has been fractured. Well, he's part of the security team. Uh, okay. Some of us are filling in. At least that's what he used to do. Yeah. Is it true? They said drop everything and report for you. And no one was expecting an arc to finally show up. Yeah. Well, Talking people... procedures agree <laughs> it's so the weird. People are zapping around. Is there to merge Hyperion power into the grid? Okay. Oh, it's her. I didn't notice, but she'll be one of our crew members. Oh, cool. On the left. Yeah. I believe that's her. It looks like the okay. same one from later. Good Hello. luck. What's up? Thanks. I'm Jaren Tan, director of the initiative. Hi. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. <sighs> means more to us. Yeah. Being Not alive. Not as much as it means to us. We had one hell of a time getting here. Nice to see some friendly faces. Yeah. Hungry faces. Any supplies you can spare would be appreciated. Oh, okay. This is Foster Addison. She oversees colonial affairs. Okay. Where's the Pathfinder? You're looking at her. It's me now. Yeah. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's dead. He made me his successor. And now you think I murdered him because Alec. of how I said that. Yep. You're dead. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Please understand. The entire <laughs> initiative is at risk. Okay. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust. And there's been oh, no good. word from the other arcs. What happened? Yay. Unknown. <laughs> Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. Right, Rose. Well, we brought some. We need to yeah, find more some. But that takes people. And we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A golden world. Yep. Now more than ever. We need a Pathfinder. It now falls to what you, about I Pathfinder role-playing game? <laughs> I got that in the car. Yep. Ooh, shit. Well. Um. I'm ready. Bam. I can do it. Up and do what needs to be done. I can handle it. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. Yeah, well, it's That's all I got right now, exist. so. Hello. Hello. By the way, like female Krogan. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Of this station. Hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, but now isn't the time. I like her face marks. I know she's cool. At least the Pathfinder here seems willing to try. We could use a fresh perspective. You've heard my okay. concerns. I'll leave you to it. Hey, don't be a grumpy pants. I seriously just got here. <laughs> yeah, she's a grumpy push. We're all feeling yep. the pressure. Yeah, I can tell. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. I'm happy to work out the details with your associate. Okay. My associate. Yep. Welcome to the Nexus. Thank you for helping. Yeah. Thank you for standing up for me there. Mm, hopes in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance. Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Okay. Let me show you something. You have cool yellow hair, that lady. She does. An hour ago, that was all dark. 
But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have nice. Lights. Well, that's a start. And when the power runs out, you'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. Okay. And don't be shy. Ooh, that's Come pretty. see me when you have a chance. Oh, so we're gonna like help build the Nexus, basically, yeah. and be like in charge of it. Well, I think so because if you look in the top right. Nexus level oh, one. Snap. Yeah, it looks like okay. there's. Okay. We have extra tasks. Nice. Oh, we have to speak with four different people: Tan, oh Cash, Candros, and Addison. Okay. Well, let's get to it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay. So first, I'll show you. Uh, oh, I guess we're up here. Okay. Uh, where's the floors? There we go. Ah. So there's more down there. Okay. Yeah, you'll see the place. Okay. Yeah. We'll find our headquarters. Who do you want to talk to first? Um, well, let's go to talk to Tan, right? Okay, he's the, director. the director, dude. So he's over this way, if I recall. Yeah, let's go see what his ideas are and see if he can give us a scout ship. <laughs> no! <laughs> I don't want to be friends. <laughs> he's the technician. Whoa, did I just jump? Whoa, what was did that? Did you see her? Yeah, I did. Hold on. What did you do? I, like, she did a hop. And, like, her arms flailed Yeah, up, I like... saw that. That's, that was weird. Okay. I liked it. Whoa! This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we found. Boo. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. Okay. Uh, what are the emotions on both of those? Um, about time, I guess? Okay. Good. I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here. Director <laughs> Addison is entitled to her opinion. And mine overrules ours. Does she okay. Know that? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. Hooray! To that end, the score is dealt as a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial okay. energy cloud? It wasn't here it's when huge. we left the Milky Way. Yet it rendered all the golden worlds unlivable. Yeah. And there's the aliens you ran into. The cat. They're obsessed oh, cat. with alien structures we found yeah. scattered around. It's the like your name. They'll do anything yep, to me. You're an alien. Accessing them. Well, it's obviously. Murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now oh, the hey, good. To settle a world in spite of all that. This one here. Eos. Eos. How? You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more okay. colonists out of stasis. Okay. The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Okay. Sounds, Sounds fun. Deep. Yeah. Depends on it. There are six worlds. No pressure. Planet. Okay. Hey, but you said every planet you found is unlivable, so how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Whoa, right. rude. I think I should go check on things. <laughs> okay. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Okay, well, just point the way. Just point me to my ship, and I'll be out of here. They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. <sighs> Ow. Okay. Sam. something wrong? Ryder, can you see me and Sam on the Hyperion? Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No. I'm fine. Sorry, I just had to listen to my brain voices for yeah, a second. Yeah, you know, brain voices. <laughs> they, they happen from time that to time. That just is a thing. So there's the other arcs they mentioned. Okay. Um, wait. In the codex, I think. Because, yeah, the other arc species, you got Krogan. Okay. You got your Solarians. Yes. And you got your Turians. Yay, I like all of them. Um, and do they talk oh, about their so arcs? Blah, 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 blah. Is it? Nope. Oh that's god. Nexus. Oh my god. Oh, nope. Nope. Geez. Nope. Oh my brain. This is cool though. Actually, uh, you get to read what you did. These are the choices you made. Oh, okay. You tried to initiate peaceful first contact despite their hostility. You explored an alien laboratory, found a cave full of plant life, okay. discovered alien shuttlecraft, rescued Greer, and expressed doubts about accepting the role of Pathfinder. <gasps> no, my doubts. They were expressed. And then this is the so far what we have with your dad. Okay. Yep. I imagine these these apparently will evolve as you make choices okay. throughout the game. Huh, interesting. So here, we'll talk to him about... <clears throat> Ryder, you have my condolences for your father. I appreciate it. I didn't Thank know him you. very well. 
Although I understand he played a key role in planning the initiative. I'm sure he'd be concerned that we still have several arcs missing. What happened to them? Any idea where they went? Nothing certain. But tens of thousands of colonists are unaccounted for. It paints the initiative in an unflattering light. Did you have some well, other business? Yeah. Um, let's see. Missing arcs? Boop. Any more information you can give me on the missing arcs? No, and that is the distressing part. No, the hey, Sorry, <laughs> Turian, and Salarian arcs are completely unaccounted for. If they had the same problems with the scourge that we did, I fear the worst. Mm. Should you find any clues, please investigate. Without the other arcs, the promise of the initiative can never be fulfilled. Okay. Uh, additional arcs? Boop. Are there any other arcs we should expect? We had hoped Quarians would be part of the first wave. But before departure in 2185, we got word they had technical problems with their ship. Oh no. It seems they're also bringing along Drell, Hanar, and other species as well. Managing okay. all of their biological needs cause complications. We won't see them for some time to come. Okay. Well, um, hopefully eventually. Yeah, I hope so. <clears throat> okay, excuse me. What about Nexus troubles? Bloop. Sounds like the Nexus has had a rough time of it. Publicly, I would say we're more than up for the challenge. Privately, I can tell you it's been a disaster. <laughs> <laughs> we killed hundreds. Many of them our senior leadership. Even the founder of the initiative, Jean Garson, is dead. Jean Garson's death? She was the one we saw on like the video. Yeah, yeah, I remember earlier. her. Yeah. How did Jean Garson die? With the rest of the leadership. When the Nexus hit the scourge, a large wing of stasis pods was destroyed. They were mm. killed instantly. These people traveled 600 years and died before they even woke up. Jean mm. Garson never glimpsed Helios. She never saw her vision realized. No. Well, that's sad. sad. Yeah. Uh, mysteries on Habitat 7? We came across alien technology on Habitat 7. It seemed to affect the weather. Your people know anything about that? Do you know what there rain is? Reports. No. <laughs> Sunshine? Mention advanced structures of unknown design. Whatever they are, they defy explanation. But with our resources stretched so tight, no one has had a chance to study them. And what if the answer was bad for morale? Suppose these things turn people into food. <laughs> we kind of oh, already no. are food if yeah. you cook us long enough, I guess. Yeah. I'm sure the cat would eat us. Uh, planet viability? We don't know what they do. <laughs> what do I need to consider in making a planet viable? Assuming the planet supports life, an outpost is critical. People like a roof over their heads, and you'll want to eliminate any hostile threats. Okay. Whether that's the cat or other terrors lurking in Helios, colonists being murdered on sight can be discouraging. <laughs> a little bit. Sense, yeah. ...is a priority for any Pathfinder. And don't forget forward stations. You'll want those. Forward stations? Yeah. This is telling us, I guess, a bit about, about how stations? we are going to explore yeah. planets, which is fast. really cool. Yeah. It's mostly what the engineers tell me. A forward station allows mining, equipment repairs, and resupply for field teams. I mean, who wouldn't want that? <laughs> <laughs> wouldn't you? You should buy one. Fifty nine ninety nine. Thank you. It's just theory at the moment. You get to test it out, Ryder. Oh, hey, cool. Yay, Good job, me. Uh, the Andromeda Initiative. Hooray. What more can you tell me about the initiative? It represents the greatest migration ever attempted. No one had ventured beyond the Milky Way before. We've all left home in search of freedom, fortune, perhaps a new beginning. We are the bravest souls each species has to offer. I hope the Nexus will serve as the seat of government for us all. Cool. Huh? Uh, motivations for coming. Why do you think most people came? There are thousands of reasons. One for every colonist here. Some of these questions seem like a little basic for, yeah, it's interesting. for what we should know, but... I don't know, I like knowing all of them. Well, it's it's, it's necessary because the player doesn't know. Yeah. But we can't facilitate you would think the daughter of like yeah, the lead like, pathfinder... Yeah, she's like, what is it? Yeah. <laughs> what the Nexus? Um, alien species on Nexus? It looks like a melting pot around here. The Nexus is home to several initiative species. Many came ahead of the Arcs. The okay. hope is that this station will one day serve as the governing body in Andromeda. Though I'm not sure what they were thinking, lumping Krogan into the mix. 
Rude. Yeah. I tend to have a little opinion of them. Oh, really? Nothing I've seen here has changed that. Didn't. You know what? There's a. I think that changes. Yeah. Eventually. Although they don't know. Yeah, like, I know. It's already happened in yeah. current time, but there's no way for them to know because yeah. when they left, it hadn't. Um. Other questions. Ooh. Ooh, 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 yeah. Let's ooh. just let's go. Okay. I can ask him about his role, I guess. Sure. As director of the initiative, are you in charge around here or what? If the others would allow me, they don't see me as the rightful successor. Why the doubt? What's their problem with you? I am not Gian Garson. Our founder was charismatic, eccentric, larger than life. Traits I cannot hope to mimic. Hmm. She and her inner circle perished in the scourge, some at the hands of the exiles, some never made it out of stasis. I was deputy assistant for revenue management. Oh. Seven leaders above me died. I was next in line for the role. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Uh, revenue management? So, you're an you're accountant? An accountant? <laughs> Don't let that fool you. Uh. We are all capable of more than we know. When I was young, I was fascinated by the idea of exploring space. Life had its detours, and I went a different direction. Then, I heard about the initiative, and saw my chance to try the path not taken. Oh my While gosh. I may not be setting foot on new worlds, my authority can ensure that you do. Okay. Right. Sorry. Well, as long as you give us stuff, I'm happy with that. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess... You is that take... it for now? Yeah, we can go ask oh, the uh, thanks for your time. some of the other people. We can I'll introduce ourselves to the yeah. other players. We'll find our futures depend on each other's success. Good luck. Good luck to you. Oh, thank you, buddy. Take luck. Thanks for all the luck. Take care of all the luck you might have. Huzzah! If you have luck, take it. Careful. Take it with you. Is there nothing to... Z z you have nothing to scan. You can't zap I anything. I guess not. All right, well, not I guess we'll take a break. there. <laughs> And next time, uh, who should we go speak to uh, next? Who else do we have to talk to? We have to talk to, uh, that's the missing arcs. There we go. We'll speak with Kesh. Candorous uh, Addison. And the scientists. And scientists. Yeah. Okay, well, it, I guess we're going to go walk around and get to know some more people next time. Yeah. So we'll do that tomorrow. See you guys later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.